Good morning, my YouTube friends, my YouTube family. How are y'all doing today? So today is, let's see what day it is. Today is Thursday, December the 22nd, and we got two days left for Christmas. I hope y'all got all your Christmas shopping done. Um, I certainly did, but I did my Christmas shopping right here in this bedroom, right here. Um, I thought I was going to spend Christmas alone because I usually do. Um, I don't really have a lot of places to go for Christmas, but um, Robert and I usually spend Christmas right here by ourselves. But since um, Robert's not here, um, and I'm going to be making a video and explain all that to y'all, so don't worry right now, but stay tuned for a new video. But anyway, um, my son reached out to me and said that I was not going to spend Christmas by myself and um, they're going to come and send somebody to get me on Christmas Eve, probably in the middle of the afternoon, and come spend the Christmas with them. So they're going to bring me back and um, I won't be leaving Charlie overnight. So I'm going to have a good Christmas with them and thank the Lord for that. So y'all continue to pray for me. I need all the prayers I can get right now because I'm going through a really rough time. But enough about that. So um, I got a card in the mail. So I was so happy because, you know, with everything going on this year, I had forgot to tell y'all to send me Christmas cards and I'd send y'all one back. But um, I forgot to do that. So that's mine. So, oh look, a little red truck. Little red truck with the Christmas. Isn't that cute? Look, let me go get some. I want to show you something. So I just went and got this off my coffee table. Look at that. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Perfect. Look at that. Thank you so much. This little truck is a Dollar General truck. And it has little Christmas lights in it. Can y'all see those Christmas lights lighting up? So I have it on my coffee table because this is my Christmas tree this year. And um, I didn't even go out in the shed and try to get my Christmas stuff out. So that's really nice. So let me see. So may your holiday traditions bring you joy and peace. I love your channel so much. May God may God keep you and Robert in good health. Rhonda. Thank you so much, Rhonda. <laughs> and Merry Christmas. And um, it's just rough right now. But anyway, I did not go penny shopping Tuesday because I just couldn't get out of bed. But, um, I did go yesterday. <laughs> I didn't want to do this, but anyway. <sighs> breathe, breathe, breathe. <sighs> so I went to three stores yesterday. No, that's not true. I only went to, um, two stores. And, uh, I picked up some penny stuff. So, um... <sighs> I had to go up there and get my, I had to leave the house and go pick up a prescription at the drugstore yesterday. So I just went by two of the Dollar Generals that I have to go right by to get there and just to see what I could find. So um, it's the fall harvest is what's pennied right now and that's what we're looking for. And any old pennies we find, well that's just a bonus. But um, let me just show you. I went in the Dollar General and I walked back by the NCI area and four of these were just leaning up against those three tables you know they got those three tables that stack under each other that are in the NCI area at the beginning of the two aisles so these we're just leaning up against the table, and all I could see was this gather. Now, everything that's been fall harvest has been gathering, 
and um, I saw this, and I was like, oh, that's just got to be Fall Harvest. So I turned one over and looked, and it has that F22 on it for Fall of 22. So I just picked them all up, and I just tucked them under my arm because I did not have... I did not have a basket. I had one of those little yellow hand carry baskets. And these would not fit in there. So um, I went ahead and scanned one of them before I got to the register. Just so I didn't embarrass myself. Because a lot of times things that you think are pennies sometimes are not. Um, so I just went ahead and scanned them. Now these are, are cool because these are pictures. And they've already got the little picture thing on the back just so you can hang it on the wall so that's really cool so I got four of those so I'm really excited about that and then let's see look at this this is an NCI um, these this was on the shelf where they keep the coffee cups and the glasses in the NCI area so when I saw it was a black milk bucket, um, you know, I've got a milk bucket video because my uncle, when I was a kid, owned a dairy, and this reminds me of that so much. But anyway, um, it says fall of 22 on the back, very small, and um, it is part of the fall harvest, so I got me a milk bucket. Now, I've got one of these sitting on my kitchen counter. It's smaller than this, but it's from like two years ago. And I, I keep my wooden spatulas in it by the sink, by the stove. So, um, those are good for stuff like that. And this was sitting on a shelf in an aisle. And I don't remember which aisle it was, but as soon as I saw it, it was like, I'm pretty sure that's fall harvest so uh, yeah this is twelve dollars and I got it for a penny but in that pretty little fall colors and then uh, I walked by the candles and uh, I was looking at them and these were on the top shelf and on the top shelf by the candles uh, on the end cap candles um, these were on the top shelf, but there was like some Febreze and stuff sitting up there, and these were like behind it. And I don't know if they were just sitting there because they're supposed to be there, or if somebody put them there, trying to hide them, but I saw them behind that Febreze. And these are a orange diamond candle. Now that orange diamond right there is what you're looking for for the penny candles. Because our fall harvest, the orange diamond is fall harvest, and they have a F22 date on them. So these were a penny. So I got two of them. They have three wicks in them. It's really a faint smell. But it's called maple and chai. And then these are the big candles. And these are perfect harvest. And they've got the blue pumpkin on them. And they are a penny. And they're vanilla amber scented. And that don't smell that bad. It's kind of a mild smell too. But I got two of those, so I got four candles for a penny each. So, um, here's my receipt. One, two, three, four. And then that flower arrangement. And then... You know how I love flowers. Miss Peggy loves flowers. So I went by the um, flowers and I saw there was some fall harvest looking flowers sticking out. 
So, um, I started scanning them. And look, I got me a whole bag of flowers. Uh, look at those. Aren't those pretty? Fall colors are my colors. In my years of dressing in colors and clothes, um, years ago they had uh, people that would tell you what your colors were. And mine was always uh, autumn. Autumn colors is what looks good on Miss Peggy. So all of these flowers are fall harvest and they don't say fall harvest, but they are just with this tag on them. But they say fall F, F22 right there. And they are a penny. So any of them that you find that looks like fall in their colors. And you know spring would be like pink and... Um, Here's some, aren't those pretty? I love those. Those are daisy looking flowers. And then you got these. Now I've got uh, one of those buckets on a table by my back door. And it has tons and tons of these flowers just sticking in it. So I always have a huge arrangement. So... Um, now this one, that's the fall color, and it was a penny, and these are just like cotton seed plants. Now, my great-grandmother lived in Rockwall, Texas, Fate, Texas, out on the other side of Lake Ray Hubbard and she had a cotton farm and I remember seeing these cotton pods in the fields and my brother and I would walk over there and we would pick some of them and from what I remember of them they're really kind of um, hard hard plants and then the cotton just kind of puffs out of those things but here's some more yellow ones and they just have the little $6 artistry on them. But look for the F-22 on the back. These are. Now, I love these. I, I don't know why and I don't know what these are. But I love these. And I got some of these last year. And they're on my back porch. But, um, yeah. And these are right here are cattails. Now, I used to have... Let me see if I can get this. Hello. <laughs> I used to have a log cabin that I inherited from my parents when they passed away. That was on a lake. It was lakefront property. And down by the water, by the boat dock, they had cattails. And I was always going down there and uh, trying to pick them. And I would put them in a vase at the log cabin. But, lo and behold, I didn't know when the cattails start to get old, these little cattail things start to shed. And I started getting those little puffy things all over the floor. So, um, yeah, so y'all look look at the flowers. Don't forget the flowers, because the managers a lot of times forget the flowers. Now, here's another, here's another some fall flowers that's got that little blue tag on it. And then here's a little fall flower. Let me get a drink of my cappuccino. It is like 7 o'clock in the morning. Just barely daylight outside. Now this says F22 on the bottom. So, and it looks like autumn. That's an autumn color. And it was a penny. Now, I don't know what this is. Um, it says for decoration only. 
Um, I guess you could just put flowers in them. Like that. <laughs> but it was a penny. And, um... And on these, I was standing in an aisle, and I was scanning stuff. And a lady that works there, she wasn't a manager, but she works there. And I've seen her before, and she knows who I am. She just said something to me, and uh, she goes, Are you looking for pennies? And I just turned and looked at her. And you know my motto, I talk to nobody about pennies. Not the workers, not the employees, not the manager. They talk to me about pennies. I listen. I say, okay. I don't volunteer anything. Nothing. So, she told me, she goes, right over there behind you, hanging on that, um, uh, what do you call, belt strip, hanging down on the corner of an aisle, she goes, those are a penny. And I go, what? She goes, those scented sacks with the pumpkins on them over there, right by you, are a penny. And I go, and I looked at them, and I had seen them before, and I looked at them, and I was like, oh, yeah. So I grabbed them, and I said, thank you. And I love these things. Um, they smell so good, and they're made. They're like uh, scented sachet things. You put them in your drawers. It says you can put it in your car, in your in your closet, your bathroom, in your trash cans. Um, and I, I don't think you're supposed to open them. I think you're just supposed to set them around like smell good things. But those were a penny. And then I saw these. These were still... Well, here's another one of those. I had three of them. But these were still in the gray totes sitting on the front porch of... This Dollar General, and I've been getting, that's where I got a lot of my 90% off the harvest stuff, was in her boxes. She had like two, four, five gray totes sitting in a carrying thing for them on the front porch. So she had took everything out of there that was fall that would have pennied, except these were laying in the bottom of it. And I was like, well, she missed a few. And so I was like, okay, well, these are just those, like, little window sticking things and gel window clings. And I've had these before, and I kind of like them. You know, nobody can see them from the street, but you definitely can see them out your window. So, you know, they got the fall harvest thing on them right there. So they was a penny. And then... Got a little pumpkin, and it's got an R on it. Rest in peace. Okay, so... Uh, that's all I have that I got for a penny yesterday. So, um... That is my haul for my fall harvest stuff. So, um... Two days till Christmas, and I will be back because I'm going to make a video, uh, another couple of videos I got planned between now and Christmas, so uh, I love y'all, adios from North Texas, and goodbye from Cowtown, and y'all have a Merry Christmas, and y'all get your Christmas shopping done, uh, I was lucky, like I said, uh, when my son said I'm going to come to their house for Christmas, um, I went through all my penny stuff, and I was able to get um, swimming pools and uh, boot socks and um, all kinds of things that I pulled out and made a Christmas haul for them. So I got to wrap them today. But um, yeah, so it's always good to be able to Christmas shop in your own penny room. <laughs> but so that's all. So I love y'all. Bye now.